Hi guys, we're still here at the Power Food Bank. It's coming up to five o'clock, so we're just wrapping up now. It's fantastic to see that we've got the ward councillor for this for this area, councillor Vic Ashford, who's also the portfolio member for Equalities. I'd like to just point out, if it wasn't for them, this function would not happen. So thank you, we really appreciate that. You've, you've spent some time here today now. How do you think today's event's gone so far? I think it's been a brilliant event and it's met every expectation and exceeded them. Um, so many people have come through the doors and said what a positive experience that they've had. It's welcoming, it's warm, it's festive, um, and it gives people a bit of dignity as well. So I think today's been an amazing day. The pop-up food bank is a sort of a unique idea, uh, not that common, hopefully it will become common. Uh, do you think this can be used as a template for other boroughs or other organisations to sort of roll this out as well? I think it's a very interesting model. We've worked really closely with collaboration with the council and ourselves. Um, the team effort has been amazing and we want to certainly to be supporting you going forward in the future. It's a very good concept to get the food to where it needs to be in these really difficult times. Uh, finally, as you can see, the wall behind us is our supporters' wall. We've had over 52 organisations that have locally supported us. There's been many others who decided not to put the logo on the board. Any final words in regards to the feeling that we gave that it's a borough-wide campaign, not just a council or a Wolf Price Islamic Association campaign, but it's been a borough-wide campaign involving many organisations? Yeah, I think the best campaigns are where people do come together, so where you've got businesses working hand in glove with organisations like yourselves, other community groups, the council. Um, that's when you will have the biggest impact for the people who need it most. And once again, thank you, Councillor Vicky and Wolf Press Council for partnering us up on this project and hopefully there will be many more in the future. Thank you.